So the informational meeting, for those who are unfamiliar, it's basically the inverse of a job interview. Job interview, a company invites you to interview, you accept, they ask you questions, which you answer and hopefully get an offer. An informational meeting, you request the meeting, so you manage the agenda. You probably may have heard that you're not supposed to ask for a job in these meetings, but what are you supposed to ask instead that hopefully leads to a job at some point? It's very secret handshake. So I created a framework called TRO, which is a essentially a questioning algorithm that helps even novice job seekers, but it works just as well for more experienced ones to manage that conversation in a structured manner that maximizes the odds that you can turn a total stranger into a potential advocate in just a half an hour. Now, the journey that Tiara takes people on is it first uses small talk to establish likability. Then after you've established likability, it's too early to ask for help. So you want to prime creativity by portraying them as an expert in their field, which they absolutely are compared to you, even if it's just at their own company. And that involves asking questions, trend questions, followed by insight questions. Trend questions are big, macro, open-ended. Where do you think this space is headed? Whereas insight questions are a little more personal. And around the middle of the conversation, we start shifting the frame away from portraying this person as an expert towards portraying them as a potential mentor. We use trend and insight questions to prime creativity so that when we ask for advice now, we're more likely to get quality advice. They've been warmed up. So nobody wants to give you a non-thoughtful or bad answer to where do you think this space is headed five years from now? Uh, they, you might be the only person who asked them this in, in, your, in this entire year. So it's a flattering and fun question to answer. Making them the hero in your story instead of asking for yourself, that's a great way to get empathy. Make people feel the pain of what it's like to be back in a job search. But then resources is the key of the, the conversation, the pivot. What resources do you recommend I look into next? This is where we hopefully get a referral, but when we request these meetings, we do not say they're about jobs. We say they're about insight and advice, and we honor that. So if people offer us referrals, that's great. If not, we'll follow up for those a week later over email, but we want to stay true to our word and focus on picking as much information out of this person's brain.